Renewable energy is poised to cause a silver squeeze. Silver doesn't get the love it should amongst its critical electric metal peers. It has lagged nickel and copper over the last three years. Solar power is driving silver demand. In 2023, solar PVs will consume an additional 21 million ounces of silver. That's 2% of overall total demand, a very meaningful figure. Silver demand forecasts from the solar sector have always been pessimistic. Let's have a look back in 2020. The Silver Institute forecast that silver demand from solar would top out at 100 million ounces. In actuality, three years later, demand from solar came in at a whopping 161 million ounces, double than what they originally estimated. We believe the market will continue to underestimate silver demand from clean tech. The World Bank estimates that by 2050, there will be five times more solar demand from silver. Put another way, that's 50% of demand of all silver today. We present two key ways to play the coming silver squeeze. The highest leverage will be through investing in junior miners. Our preferred plays are Dolly Varden and Suma Silver. For those looking for traditional physical exposure, there's iShares Silver Trust. Let's take a deeper look at the silver miners. Dolly Varden operates out of the Golden Triangle in Canada's province of British Columbia, the home of the original West Coast Gold Rush. In only two years, Dolly Varden has discovered close to 90 million silver equivalent ounces of inferred resource through smart geological targeting and an ambitious drilling program. The Golden Triangle is already home to many world-class gold and silver deposits, having seen over 5 billion in recent m and activity. Dolly Varden is backed by both Eric Sprott and Hecla Mining. In 2023, the company will undertake a 45,000 meter drill program that could see a significant increase in resource. Suma Silver is an explorer operating out of properties in New Mexico and Nevada, founded by a group of geologists with years of experience successfully exploring for silver and gold. They believe significant value can be created by focusing on prematurely closed mines and underexplored production areas. Take their Hughes project in Nevada, for instance. The rocks have similar geological and production characteristics to some of the largest gold and silver districts in Mexico. Like Dolly Varden, Sumer has been funded by major mining investors like Eric Sprott with an 18% stake. Renewable energy is truly a game changer for silver. The silver squeeze can now be delivered from two catalysts, monetary debasement and growth in clean technology.